G'day and welcome to another winter edition of 2 Minute Tips on odt.co.nz uh, As always, I don't like to change things up too much A couple of videos to look at this week uh, First one I'll look at is for Addington on Friday night Race 8 at uh, 5 minutes past 9 Horses at number 2, Mostel Major uh, Was fresh up last start at Timaru uh, last Sunday I thought pretty good effort really Got up and ended up sitting parked for a fair duration of the race uh, hit the lead with about 200 metres to go and just got run down just in probably the last 50 or 100 metres. Uh, other ones to look out for here are probably Dalton Bromac, uh, drawn out wide though which uh, could cause a few problems. And Spirit Eclipse which is uh, drawn right inside uh, Mostel Major so could easily cop the trail here. But let's go back and have a look at that Timaru run and just uh, notice that maybe Mostel Major just lose a little bit of condition in that last 50 metres. Favourite hits the lead, Mossdale Major. Still there, Caesar. Out wide, a change. Time's getting out of the ground. It's Mossdale Major. Joined on the outside by change time on the outside of those. Hit the spot. Mossdale Major change time and hit the spot. Hit the spot, I think, just over change time. Third over, Mossdale Major. Off to the Wellington Steeplechase meeting at Trentham on Saturday. And the Steeplechase is the race we're looking at. Race 7 at uh, 11 minutes past 3. Palimo and Volkswagen. Now they ran the Quinella and the Hawks Bay steeplechase a couple of weeks ago and I'm quite keen on these two again. Palimo was very good uh, running away over the last 200 metres but the key with both of them is they've both got form on the Trentham track and of course this uh, Wellington steeplechase is run on a figure eight for a, a large part of the race so they do have to be able to turn quite uh, tightly at times and just uh, yeah, adapt to uh, going back and forth. So let's go back and have a look at that run uh, at Hawke's Bay where Palimo will just to pick up the action just after he jumps the last fence and is about to run away. Look out for Volkswagen uh, just running on a wee bit. He got over it okay. Tim had a bit of a life. Dane Ruler, Volkswagen, Cape Canaveral, and I'm Isaac whacking away. It's Palimo and Matthew Gillies in front by five links on Volkswagen and Dane Ruler. And Palimo will take out the Hawks Bay chase by seven links. Second over Volkswagen. Uh, so that's the form for the Wellington Steeplechase. I thought the other horse maybe to look out for is Tim. Uh, has been a bit of a season star earlier on in the season. Uh, just finished fourth in that uh, Hawke's Bay race. But probably worth going again, especially only carrying the 66 and a half. Uh, in terms of other racing this weekend, we've got uh, one over to Moon, the Waimati owned uh, trotter, lined up on Friday night at Melton. Uh, we've got Omru Harness on Sunday for the local fans. Uh, head along there. It's not bad fields actually for a, a July meeting. And of course, uh, you've got the Harness Carnival, talking more Harness, sorry, uh, Harness Carnival on Saturday night uh, at Queensland Carinol, where you've got the Group 1 Oaks for Queenslanders, and also the Queensland De uh, Gold Coast Derby for the three-year-olds over uh, Group 3 status. Until next time, uh, hopefully we'll get rid of this cold by next week. Uh, we'll see you then.